When I entered the field of radio astronomy as a student, I was told about this enigma, this mysterious radio source, Sege Star, at the heart of our galaxy. I observed it at long wavelengths, and there it appears to be blurred. It's very exciting here today to show you today this best ever image of that enigma, Sege Star. So we start out from the plains of, uh, uh, of Chile, where the ALMA telescope is located. And we're going to zoom in to Sagittarius, the archer, which is high in the sky uh, above the, uh, northern Chile. And we will go and zoom in first in the optical, but we have to switch to the infrared because there we can penetrate all the way into the galaxy. We leave tens of millions of stars behind and we get to the place where stars are in orbit about a, around a dark spot. And when we switch then to our radio eyes and we use a network of telescopes to resolve further and further, I can present to you the image of Sege Star, the black hole at the galactic center. This is the first image of the supermassive black hole at the heart of our Milky Way galaxy, Sagittarius A star. For decades, we have known about a compact object that is at the heart of our galaxy that is four million times more massive than our sun. Today, right this moment, we have direct evidence that this object is a black hole. The black hole resides inside the dark region at the center of this image where its gravitational pull is so strong that light cannot escape and only darkness remains. We call this region the shadow of the black hole. This region is surrounded by very hot gas swirling around the black hole. This gas emits radio waves we observe with the Event Horizon Telescope. These radio waves create the glow we observe around the shadow of the black hole. From our image, we measure the size of the shadow of Sagittarius A star to be 52 micro arc seconds on the sky. This is about the size of a donut on the surface of the moon as seen from Earth. In reality, Sagittarius A star is about as big as the orbit of Mercury around the sun, but at a distance of 27,000 light years. Because the size of a black hole shadow is proportional to its mass, our image tells us that the mass of Sagittarius A star is four million times greater than that of our sun. It is really incredible that this prediction from Einstein's theory of general relativity matches the mass measured by the Nobel Prize winning studies of stellar orbits in our galactic center. <laughs> 